Welcome to Control M video solutions for workload automation series. In this video, we will show you how to uninstall a Control M agent in Unix and Windows environments manually when the installation procedure is unable to uninstall due to an environmental problem. The procedures to install or uninstall included in our product usually cover many situations. Um, where if there's an issue, the installation rollback is usually used to resolve uh, such problems. However, there may be unexpected situations where a rollback facility uh, fails and therefore manual, manual uninstallation is, un is required. And for this, we will need to de demonstrate the steps needed in the two most used environments in Unix and uh, Microsoft. Let's start with Unix, where due to a problem in the environment, I need to uninstall manually my agent installed in the account named AG18. The first step is to verify there are no processes running in the OS of the Control M agent. After that is done, I will then contact uh, the system admin to delete everything under the home directory of the control, uh, the home directory of the account AG18 and the user AG18 as well. As shown in this procedure, after this, the environment should be ready to install for installation again and our assistant, assistant and me should be able to create an account to proceed with the inst installation of the product. Next is the Windows environment where we will carry out the same procedures like in Unix, uh, verify that the, the agent is down and there are no processes running in the OS with an MP underscore CTMA. We will then proceed to delete the agent services defined in the machine ex by executing the command, the commands shown on the screen. Next, we will open the control panel to verify the name of our agent. In this case, its name is default. The following step will then require a cleanup of the registry in the machine. So we will execute regedit and delete everything and uh, the following registry paths. After that, delete the home directory of our agent and all files under it. After completion of that step, We will need to do a backup of our registry from the regedit utility with the option export. As we can see, our agent no longer appears in the list of products installed and the machine is ready to reinstall the control M agent. Thank you for watching. And this concludes our Control M video solution. Please vi visit our YouTube channel for more videos like this.